When I buy red peppers at the store, I like to look for ones that feel light for their size, all right? Which means that there's not a lot of seeds inside. If you're paying by weight, that's gonna make a difference, right? So I like to do that. I like to look around, see that there's no bruising uh, either, or it, they tend to get little moldy uh, spots on them. So what I did, I just cut off the top. You can see right here. Don't throw this away. We're going to chop that up as well. I'm going to turn it around and cut off the bottom. This is a beautiful pepper. Oh my goodness, I love it. It's nice and the color is very rich. Remember what I was saying about antioxidants. So one of the things about eating this way, it is anti-inflammatory because of all the antioxidants that are in these vegetables. The darker the color, the more antioxidant power that vegetable has for you. So look for those things. Remember I was saying with the celery here, how nice dark green it is. That means that there's more antioxidants in it for us and it's better for us and is helping us age less quickly. All right, I'm gonna pull out the seeds from the center and just, I like to reach in and just pull out some of that softer, whiter tissue that's in there so that I have something that looks a little bit like this. All right, then, I, then I'm going to slice it down lengthwise. All right, so we have something that looks like this. All right, and just for ease, I like to just cut out some of that center membrane if it's big. And I'm also going to cut out, you can see on this side, I still have a little bit of the bottom left on it. I'm just gonna cut that out as well. You can use this if you'd like. I'm gonna put it in for my soup stock. Now, here's, remember when I said I was going to show you how to make sticks for your uh, veggie sticks and hummus? At this point, what we want to do is we want to make julienne strips. Now, you just have to cut down. And there you have your sticks. 